And I just, I want to go back uh, really quick. You know, when you say that AI has been trained on the entire internet, what, what jumps out to me, and we talked a little bit about this offline, is there's, there's a timing issue. So mm -hmm. if AI is predicting an outcome, but it is not getting feedback as to whether its prediction was correct, or if it is getting that feedback, it's not getting it in the case of a, you know, a legal scenario for years, how is it learning? It can't learn in real time like a human. It doesn't know like a judge whether, you know, they got their estimation on recidivism for a certain defendant correct. How do you yeah. overcome that with AI? Currently, um, I don't know that we are. Uh, these are questions that the law needs to ask, right? Like if you're if you're doing these long scale predictions, how do you know if they're sufficient or not within the short term? I don't honestly know. Like I can't feed it data I don't have. So am I pulling data from different districts and different areas? And how reliable is that? How close is that to the data from my district and my area? Like it's the reason why uh, AI systems just broke down during COVID. Um, like shopping systems. They, they couldn't, they had no, this was a, a black swan event. They had nothing in their data sets that could predict it. And then there was nothing to keep them up to speed with what was happening. Like they, it was just, they were moving along like we were moving along <laughs> and making their best guess like we were because they didn't have a pattern for it. And that, I think that should be a, you know, a, a flag for everyone. Like if there is no pattern in the data, then the AI system is no more reliable than you or me.